how many years left till you retire. And if you assume the same growth rate between now and the time that you retire, on average, right? I mean, years go like this, right? How big is your company going to be? Who's got a number for me? How big would your company be if you grew at that rate? Oh, I mean, let's see. Uh, Judy, I'm going to guess Judy. You, uh, Judy's probably 23. Um, uh, oh, 24. Got you, 24. Just hit the drinking age. Okay. You know, so, you know, whatever the age is, right? I don't need to know everybody's age, but if you take your age, at the age, Judy's age of 24, uh, yep. then to the, to the age of 70, and she put her number down as 860,000. Like I said, even if you take 86,000, or you take half of that, 400,000, whatever the number is, what is the number? If it's 300,000, if I think I can grow my business by 300,000 a year, times whatever that is, let's actually be, let's bring it here, we'll put 40, 30, make the math easy. 30 years, that's 9 million, is it? 9 million. You don't think anybody's ever built a $9 million company? We did 10 million in sales last year. All right. Thank you. And you know, I joke with people, I joke with my sales guys. I say, guys, sometimes people come into the program and they're telling you they can do things. Okay? And you're thinking, this person's psychotic. <laughs> right? They think they're gonna be so successful, they think they're gonna be they're going to be, you know, they're throwing out these numbers and you're like, this person is literally psychotic, right? But to be honest, the most successful people that have come through the program pretty much are psychotic. <laughs> yeah, it's, <laughs> it's true. Some of you know, right? Because you have to be psychotic to believe that you could do something like that you haven't done. But the only way to get it is to believe that you could do it before you have it. Otherwise, you don't even try. So you have to believe it in your mind before it happens. That's the way it works. And yeah, definitely if I would have told people that at my age and my situation that we would have done that this year, they would have said, that guy's an idiot. That guy's stupid. He's arrogant. Or whatever the case may be. But you just ignore those people and put your head down and get to work.